Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about how to simplify a fraction. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help you use Minute Math. To simplify a fraction, we're to start with this example. We're going to actually use an example to show the process here. We're asked to simplify a negative 315 over 770. So what I want to do is find the product of prime numbers for each one of these numbers, the numerator and denominator. So we've done this before with a factor tree. So let's take 315 first. 315, well, what does that break down to B as prime numbers? Well, it ends in a 5, so we know 5 goes into 315. Well, 5 times a 63 gives me that 3. 15. Now, 63 is a 9 times a 7, and 9 is a 3 and a 3. So what we can say here is that that 315 is a breakdown of these prime numbers. 3 times 3 times 5 times 7. All right. Now let's do the same thing with the denominator. 770. Well, 77, a 770 breaks down to be, well, you can guess that 10 goes into it, right? 10 times 77. 10 is a 2 times a 5, and 77 is 7 times 11. So the prime numbers multiplied for 770 is 2 times 5 times 7 times 11. And so now what we want to do is cross off the numbers that, well, are duplicated in the numerator and the denominator. So we have a 5 here and a 5, a 7, and a 7, and that's it. So this simplifies to be a negative 3 times a 3 over what's left over 2 times 11. Then from here, let's re-multiply these back out. We have a negative, 3 times 3 is a 9, and 2 times 11 is a 22. And so there we have it. We simplified the fraction, negative 315 over 770, and we got a negative 9 over 22. I hope you learned how to simplify a fraction here in the basic example. If you did, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel and like this video. This helps us make more of these fun math videos for you and for everyone else. So, as always, thanks for watching.